100 rated chess, but it's International Women's Day, your queen is MVP of the game, making the most captures, the most moves, and delivering checkmate. The last part obviously sounds way too luck based, because my opponent will most likely resign the game as my queen is causing chaos in his territory, so I guess, I'll completely delete that part. That sounds much better, but before the video begins, have you ever been in a situation that you are about to checkmate your opponent and then they said, resign right now or I'll expose your IP address to everyone on the internet? Well, with NordVPN, you don't have to worry about those guys, anymore. Is your computer full of malware because you didn't know anything about computers so you accidentally downloaded them and then don't know how to get rid of them? Well, then I would suggest you clean your SSD first, and then go for NordVPN. Are you tired of seeing unnecessary too many ads on every single website that you visit? NordVPN can remove those ads for you. Are you living in a country that bans YouTube but somehow still able to find my videos? I bet you are using NordVPN. If you are interested, check out NordVPN at their website through the link in the description below. Or if you have too much time to spare, just pause the video and type this link with your own hands in a new browser tab. Back to the game, we get a 117 from Italy. E4, E5, this makes my e pawn is the MVP of the game since he's made the most amount of moves, but in order to move my queen out, I of course need to make way for her first. Knight f3, here we go. Queen f6, the massacre, starts here. Knight takes e5. That blunders a horsey, and unlike all of those videos where there is always a random reason preventing me from taking that horsey, this time, I'll take it without a doubt. Now my queen is officially the MVP of the game, let's just not let any pieces take their position away from her. Queen f3. It's going to be hard to play with only a queen, bishop c5. Please don't offer a queen trade. Of course I cannot let my woman die on women's day. Queen e7. Also need to be careful though, I cannot let his queen be the MVP instead of my queen. My woman is better than yours. Bishop c4. Aha. He's trying to attack my f pawn, and even though my queen is obviously already defending it, there is always a chance that he cannot see it and proceed to take the pawn which forces a queen trade. So I guess. Knight f6. Completely preventing the threat is definitely the better idea. And no, I'm not a coward. e5. Very aggressive. Knight c6. To those of you who are about to comment that I'm blundering a horsey, you suck. Bishop e6. What kind of move is that? He is sacrificing his bishop just to unpin his pawn, but I cannot take his bishop with my queen because of a possible queen trade. I cannot take his bishop with my pawn because that will force him to move his queen more times than I move my queen. I also cannot retreat my knight because of the f7 pawn. So in conclusion, what the f am I supposed to do? Ha! My queen moved three times, which is the most in this game, but she has only captured once, which equals to his dead horsey. So I guess. Mission. Kinda accomplished.